Hello, you join me on a new series on the Brothers in Arms channel. This is a FIFA career mode with my beloved team Liverpool. As you can see, Mr. Bag, because if you check out the channel, you know I am the bag. Uh, so, looking at what we've got to do, a uh, Liverpool five star team, of course. Uh, got a transfer budget of 74 million, we're worth 1.8 billion. I'm assuming. Uh, give us a bit of breakdown of our of our club, um, and we've got our board expectations on the side. So I've got a, got domestic success, continental success, and brand exposure to work on, as they are all critical. So going into it, uh, as you can see, match difficulty we are playing on legendary. The aim of this series is mainly just to, I think the end game is basically win the Premier League and Champions League, and just pick up as many cups as we can uh, along the way. Uh, five minutes per half. Uh, I've enabled the transfer window because I'm like looking at it as if I'm a new manager. They're bringing me in, and I get to spend what I want. Well, what they give me anyway. Uh, I've enabled the European competitions. International job offers are turn off, and advance through. So, Mr. Bag was unveiled as a surprise new manager of Liverpool. Not a surprise. At all. Takes an awfully long time. So here we have our pre-season tournament invite. Uh, usually I wouldn't do these, but for the purpose of the series I'll advance because I know you can get a bit of extra money from them. So it shows you there the location and difficulty. Uh, so you've got the Champions Trophy, uh, quite a few good teams, quite a few low tier teams, uh, Invitational Cup, same again, uh, and the American Challenge Cup, which has got the big teams in it. Uh, I think for today we'll probably go for the mid-range one, and that's in our group, so it's Atalanta, Al-Halal, and Melbourne City. So that's just letting us know, yep. Uh, set a goal to earn 180 million in sales from player shirts should be pretty easy so these are our objectives so the youth development sign one player in your youth academy assigned to the midfielder position sign at least two young two younger than 20 years old with potential greater than the average overall rating of players currently in the same position which is going to be tough because you've got good players all around the pitch uh, but I guess we could try it uh, within three seasons, include, increase the club worth of your club by 25%. Don't know how that works out, but we'll try it. And Premier League, win the league title and win the FA Cup and win the champion. So, you know, pressure. Fantastic. Uh, first scout was reported. So that's just your basic scouting. That's just introducing himself. Uh, so what I'm probably going to do is I'll play a little browse of the transfer market. And then I'll come back when I've got a few transfer targets. So I've put a few players into me transfer hub. Uh, just looking at the positions, I could potentially either get fresh young talent in, uh, like Blinkovic, Savic, Hussein Auer, uh, and there's some places like a striker, Pietro Pellegrini. I know he's good on football manager, but I'm not so sure on FIFA. Uh, and then I'm looking for players that could potentially just go straight into the team so you got your screw in our and your open Meccanos. Uh Montiel mainly for a right back back up to our Trent Alexander Arnold. Um and we can go from there. But then looking at the players I've got on my transfer hub so I can always update you if I do get any of them. Uh, we've got seventy four million to spend so I might be able to get one two maximum. But if I get any you'll find out. So here we go, our first game of our Invitational Cup is against Al Halal. Uh, I haven't made any signings yet. The squad's still looking the same. So we've got Allison, Robertson, Van Dyke, Gomez, Alexander Arnold. Uh, midfield consists of Wayne Alden, Fabinho, and Henderson. And up front, Mane, Fabinho, 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 and Salah. So going into the first game, I am going to play these because I want the chance to win the tournament to get the transfer funds. And hopefully we can. So we'll go in red kit against white kit, and as you can see, we are playing on legendary five minute halves. See who's on the bench. So we've got Shakiri. I 
think I'll put Shakiri on the reserves. Got Kate and Milner for Chamberlain. I also do believe yeah, Harvey Elliott's been put in the game. So just because we're in a pre-season, I, I might as well. And then it might give him a bit, bit of experience to go towards him levelling up. So commence with the match. This is my first time playing legendary wise on career mode. I'm usually like world class difficulty level, but it's just it's gonna be a task for me. So let's see. For me not to kick off. So and okay. Oh, Van Dijk there again. Run it. Oh, he's got acres, acres of space. I know them, and I, I knew that was getting blocked. I just knew it. Oh, Van Dijk. Oh, ball over by Mane. Get on that rubbo. Oh, he's won it. Trent! What a finish! Of all people, Trent! Alexander Arnold! Oh, amazing. What a finish. What a header. From him, of all people. Incredible. 1 0. Pure determination by Robbo. Won the ball, put in a delicious cross, and there's Trent. Oh. What a goal. What a team goal. What is that? Stop touching it and just run. Oh, Marnie's got space. And Bobby Firmino, 2 0. Cruising. Cruising. Good team goal again. The team play is fantastic. Make it work. Look at that. Chop. In. Cross. Volley. 2 0. Good, good covering. End pass just isn't there at some point. Come on, Trent. Defensive duties. It's good enough. For, okay. Allison. That. What in God's name? That was. Mm, probably one of the worst punches out I think I've ever seen from a goalkeeper. They're gonna have a bit of momentum now, thinking he can get back into this. Let's play a bit of keep ball till the half's over. Or just give it away. That's always an option. Nice one, Virgil. Half time, 2 1. Should still be 2 0, in my opinion, but I, I thought Allison would have punched that a lot further than the edge of his box, but. Okay. Uh, yeah, that'll be alright for the second half. Can make a few changes in the 60th, 70th minute. Yes, Joe. No, Joe. Yes. Fabinho, set Mo away. He's got acres. <sighs> he can run. But there was just no end pass. Don't know where Trent's off to there. Oh, Virgil. Oh, he's away. Sees Marnie. What in God's name? 
I'd be lying down on the floor, disappointment, right? Manny's not coming off for that miss, like, but uh, Henderson could come off for Keita. Uh, and we can throw... Throw the Ox on for Wijnaldum. Just get a bit of pace in the midfield. I'm so I can't believe he didn't bury that. Open. One-on-one. -on -one. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Oxlade. Oh. Right, let it go for a corner. Hmm. Hey, yeah, that'll work. It just won't. Mo, please. Right, Marnie. Marnie. Off the post! It's all going wrong. Oxley Chamberlain! Oh. Right, um, What can we do? Probably. Could probably try and shut up shop. Get my tipping back in. Uh, get my tipping defence there. Just try and close the game out. That's all we can do. What in God's name is happening there? Oh, free one. Game closed. Sadio Mane. He's class. He's doing a dance. He's incredible. Good work around the box. Trent with an assist as well. Goal and an assist. I still can't believe they've actually scored against us. That, that still baffles me. He's offside, that's fine. Go. 3 1, first pre season game. Off to a flyer. One win. Good lads. Good lads. There we go. Look at the boys. They're happy. They're all happy. Let's have a look. I still can't believe. I mean, I've said it numerous times. I still can't believe they actually scored. Yeah, so, got a Trent, Roberto, Firmino, and Sadio Mane with the goals. Trent for 9.4, man of the match, I'd agree. I would agree. So we'll advance back into the menu. I forgot who else is in our group. We'll double check. Atalanta, so they won as well against Melbourne. It's a good start. And Melbourne's our next game as well. So we'll have a look, see what we've got mail wise. Transfer offer for Nathaniel Klein. I'll delegate that just to try and get a bit more out of them 6.5 don't sell the player for at least seven right, so let's see how they go with that okay so we'll get into the next game no new items We've not had any signings yet, just as I'm waiting for the scouts to come back with their reports for them. Uh, 9.6. I'll let him go to Napoli. 
So as soon as I get them scout report scout reports in, I can know what I'm working. Oh, there we go. It's actually speak of the devil. Uh, willing to pay seven mil for Nathaniel Klein. Yep, yeah, I'll take that. So the players we've got the, the reports on, they're all in my transfer hub actually. So come on, Jordan. Where's the transfer hub? Yeah, so you've got your transfer hub. So, Scrivener, Skir we couldn't come to an agreement. They wanted like 80 million and Lovren, so that was like 100 million transfer, and I'm, no, just not happening. So we've got Up Meccano, oh, uh, Milinkovic, Savic, Pellegri, Lazaro. I won't be able to get Lazaro because he's on loan um, from Newcastle. Montiel, only about 15 million, so that's not bad. Mainly what I want. Oh, he's not got a scout report back yet. I'd like to get Husem. I'm just going to call him that. I'd like to get Milinkovic Savage, but I doubt they'd sell him. Pellegrini's only going to cost me a million, but he'll be a good backup, like a young prospect for Firmino. And Montiel, I'd like to get. So what we'll do is. I won't bore you with all the, the transfer details, so we'll be right back with the transfer news. And we are back, so we're going to transfer news, we've done a few deals, so as you can see we've signed Montiel from, I think it was Cruz of Fool, I'm not 100% sure, oh from Nunez, 12.3 uh, million, good deal, we've bought Pellegrini for 1.5 million, uh, only 67 rated, but I sh going off football manager knowledge, he is going to be good in the future that's just what i'm basing it off and we also completed the Husem our signing 35 million and he's joined as well so we've got three new players a new backup striker uh so it'll go behind Firmino and Origi but Origi can also play on the left uh a new backup right back for Trent and a new centre mid because obviously we're selling Lalana uh, and i want him to be a backup to like the Henderson and Wijnaldum so that's three three good transfers i'd say uh, and they'll join us for our game against Melbourne City, which I'll include in next episode. This first episode was just like a little introduction, got a game in there and some transfers. So stay tuned for the next episode.